Here we are, day three. French challenge. It's still going. It's on there. I just wanted to show you a couple of the other. Yeah, you can see where it, it grabs it, right? So that's what I'm trying to explain to you guys, that AR, <clears throat> if you look, it started grabbing the front of the corner. So you guys saying it's grabbing, it's not. You can see where it started to grab. Look at it. it started to grab ahead of the corner. About an eighth inch. That's kind of where you want it. Just wait till you see the newer design. Engineering, you know. See how it started grabbing about an eighth inch before or sixteenths? It's not biting on a corner. It's just grabbing before. What AR does is that it starts grabbing that metal. And as it locks on with more pressure it just starts grabbing harder that's why it didn't come off i'm trying to this is day three this is a wrench challenge and nobody has sent me a video they're not but because the scale here is so far out from where you guys are even ending on that project farm and ave has a better setup but i kind of looked at it and i don't he might be but i don't that's why i'm showing you guys how to test them so you guys the way you guys are doing it's not going to even get close so we're we're still on a challenge uh, day three, and I nobody sent me a video of their wrench staying on, and that's what happens. You can see it's biting before the corners. Even at that pressure, it was biting before. You can see it, you see it grabbing the metal, and it's like it bites. That's why it doesn't come off. I I can't get it to come off. That's why I had to go to an NDT, a, a project farm. They're not going to do it. You need a massive press. This is 20 ton. I'm taking it up to a massive one. I, I'm trying to help out and show you guys how to test it. That's part of what I'm doing. I you know, and then we can go back to like if we're in the court of law and they say, hey, why is yours better? They're saying that you're false advertising. And then we start breaking down alloys and then it just doesn't come off. You know, it's like a David and Goliath thing, but crazy thing is is that as long as you have a couple good guys next to you you can conquer the world doesn't matter how many people you have i think that as long as you approach things correctly and the good attitude it'll it'll work itself out i i you know i've been called a lot of things a lot of you know and a lot of them are bad most of the time they're bad but sometimes people call me this kind of stuff that's okay. I consider myself a welder, but I, I love being down on the floor. I'm I'm bleeding every day with you guys. This isn't this isn't a game, man. This is my life, but I I got my life in this stuff. Wrench challenge day three. No video.